Daryl Lennington here from icnewsafrica.com and I'm joined by Donald who's a VP and distinguished analyst for Gartner. So we're currently at Gartner 2018 and we're discussing Gartner's next phrase which is continuous next. So could you elaborate for me a little bit what continuous next is all about? So Daryl, continuous next is Gartner's view of, of how organizations can win. It's a strategy for winning in a world that's continuously changing. We all know that the pace of technology change seems to be increasing all the time and we believe that organizations have to change the way that they work. Um, and it's almost a lot of it is like adopting some of the same behaviors of a software company for all types of organizations. We've been able to break it down into a simple formula that mindsets and practices, which is really another name for culture, uh, amplified by t technology, leads to new capabilities and leads to new business results. And we believe that organizations have to think differently about how they respond to changes in the marketplace with technology. It's almost a little bit like being able to adapt continuously to change and then knowing what's next. That, that's where continuous next comes from. All right. So how is continuous next going to benefit companies globally and in Africa? So we believe that the strategy of Continuous Next is really about helping organizations react and adapt more quickly to changes in technology, uh, disruptions that occur in the marketplace from, for example, from the digital giants. So we know that disruption is happening in all industries. We think it, by adopting this type of strategy, organizations can become more competitive in the marketplace, not just here in Africa, but around the world. It's really a different, it's a different mindset. It's no longer about one year, two year, three year planning horizons, but almost like continuous delivery like a software company. Okay, so overall, what can Continuous Next do for my company? Sure, so part of, um, part of what we talk about with Continuous Next are five imperatives. Um, the use of artificial intelligence to create what we call augmented intelligence, the ability of humans and machines to work together effectively. We have um, this idea of digital product management where every type of company can create digital products and services. Um, guarding your customers' privacy, uh, focusing on small things to uh, to change your culture like culture hacks. And then we have this idea of the digital twin of an entire organization. Those are five of probably a lot of different types of capabilities that an organization can use to be able to respond quickly to changes in the marketplace. All right. Just to finalize the interview, can you go a little bit more in depth into what a digital twin is? So a digital twin is a software representation of a physical object. And over the last couple of years, we've seen things like jet engines and wind turbines and trains have software representations of the entire object itself and that's being used to help organizations proact predictively maintain um, these pieces of equipment as well as in the design process. We believe that same concept can be applied to an entire organization where people, processes, interactions, and technology objects all kind of work together. So think about it as a software representation of an organization. And we shared an example from Siemens where they were able to model, um, create a digital twin of their order to cash operation, which is not there's machines, but it's mostly people doing work. They, they were able to create a digital representation of that entire process that led them to new and better business results. Um, uh, lower amounts of rework, greater efficiency, fewer touches, manual touches per transaction. So that's why we picked up on the idea that we're seeing the beginnings of it take place. Mm -hmm. And we think it, uh, over the longer term, it could be a way for Continuous Next to come to life in the digital twin of an organization. All right, perfect. So that's everything you need to know about Continuous Next as well as Digital Twins. My name is Daryl Lennington and I'm at Gartner Symposium 2018. Uh, for everything else on Gartner, stay tuned to www.itnewsafrica.com. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you, Daryl.